What's going on YouTube? Stealing likes here and you guys have caught me once again hand in the cookie jar. I'm out here trying to get me some likes today. First battle off is going to be a rating battle on Battle Spot. Now, you guys didn't get to see my last battle of the night. If you didn't notice, there weren't two battles yesterday. And that's due to the fact that my opponent forfeited and I didn't want to bring the match. Not only because my opponent forfeited, but also because my opponent is somebody in the community who's at least slightly known. And I didn't want to do that to him. So... I will be bringing an extra battle either Saturday or Sunday. I will make it up to you guys. However, I'm not going to be posting that one. So, with that in mind, let's get on with the rest of today. Now, for this first battle, I'm bringing Archeops, Heracross, Roserade, Exatu, Furfrau, and Lantern. Lantern hasn't seen much playtime here recently, and as you all know, I'm in love with my Heracross right now. Now, I'm going to go ahead and hit that challenge button, see who I can get to throw down with me, and just try to get some things going as... My opponent is hopefully a awesome opponent. Uh, I don't want to see a whole bunch of OU things or a whole bunch of Stallwally things. I mean, Stallwalls I can handle, but I don't like them, as you already know. All right, so my opponent brings Drapion and Carbink. So Archeops has to come. Camera up. Archeops is definitely coming. For Alligator, ah, I know that turtle's name. It's the new starter turtle and Roserade. So we both have a Roserade. Now my opponent's going to hate to see Archeops, and Archeops is leading. I'm also going to bring something for that Turtle and Roserade. I think Exatu would do kind of well in this matchup. I, that's my feeling anyway. Now, the Carbink is not a worry due to the Archeops. Actually, pretty much nothing here is a worry due to Archeops except for Roserade. And for Alligator. Now, for Alligator, I didn't bring Electricity. As you all might notice, I actually dropped my... Oh, I did bring Electricity. I do have a Lantern. So I will bring Lantern, because I feel like for Alligator has to be a thing here. <laughs> has to be a thing. Fastest decision I've made ever, as my opponent and I get ready to square up. Now, I'm not sure... They might lead Roserade. At which point, I'll hard switch into Exatu, just to avoid the problems as they might be carrying toxic spikes. A trick I learned from Millsy Miner is that Roserade can tote the spikes. But instead they come out with Drapion. Now Drapion's gonna hate to see Archeops and it doesn't even know why. As Archeops is going to go straight in for an earthquake. Now this should Oh carrying the berry. Uh oh, that's a problem for me, as that does not kill at all. He goes for the spikes with the Drapion. Now, Drapion's not going to appreciate this secondary EQ, which is coming no matter what. Now, let's see what I get. What kind of damage do I get now? That is a dead Drapion. That's what I was looking for this whole time. I don't have anything to remove the status problems that would be happening here. However, I don't have another... Pokemon who just goes down to an EQ. So I'm going to go for that. He's probably going to toss Stealth Rocks, as that is what one thing I do with my Carbink, is toss Rocks. Now, this should deal a hefty chunk, as I am very close in attack to this Carbink's defense. Uh, he Trick Rooms, so he is going to be able to get off some damage. However, I am not going to switch. The switch feels kind of ridiculous, although one layer of spikes, which is better than two, one layer of spikes could be alright by Lantern, but I'm not going to risk the late game here. I'm going to go straight into an Earthquake. I know he's going to do something. Oh, he Reflects. Okay. So the Reflect, obviously going to stop me from, eh, it might not stop me from murdering this Carbink, although it's a possibility. Yep, so Carbink's still around. Now, I am going to go for yet another Earthquake. Carbink should Power Gem me here. Yeah, Power Gem's going to hurt my feelings, as it drops my Archeops below half. So it's not going to be dealing the kind of damage it was before. However, the Carbink's gone, so not nearly as worried about that. I do crit, however, I am beyond certain that crit didn't matter, as the super effective damage took care of the problem. Now, we are still under the effect of Trick Room here, and Trick Room is a thing. As Camera Upt comes out, Camera Upt's going to be slower. It's not going to tote a lot of things for my Archeops, however, it will get the kill. I'm going for the Stone Edge, 
he hidden powder powders he hidden powers probably ice and that should take me out now I'm gonna go into my lantern and this should be a good game moment I'm, I'm not packing Brian although he's taken no damage whatsoever so lantern's gonna come out he's gonna get poisoned I'm not even gonna bother with the aqua ring I'm just going to go straight into some moves here as my lantern is going to scald this camera up now obviously not going to get off a ooh didn't really think that part through however the scald not gonna get too many problems out of this camera up as he goes down oh the crit probably mattered a lot right there so i 2-0 what i probably should have one owed but i hope you guys enjoyed that match now make sure to drop some comments about my play down below let me know what you would have done differently especially when it comes into my team going into the matchup as i pick things a little bit differently than some people do now, after that, make sure to leave a like, because I would love to bring Wonder Trade Wednesday next Wednesday, but I will be bringing you guys another battle tonight, so stick around, and I will see you guys later.